hapo kitambo ilikuwa tunafanya ukulima lakini hatukujua ukulima unaweza kuwa business na hapo kitambo kidogo kwa mama wa Masai walikuwa wanawekwa nyuma sana na wazee wao jamii wa nyumba mama ni wako na mizigo nyingi sana In Kenya, agriculture is the backbone of the economy, and women constitute about 70% of the agricultural labor force. Despite their majority, women in the agricultural value chains continue to face numerous challenges that lead to persistent gender inequality and reduced benefits for their agricultural activities. In line with the Sustainable Development Goals, SDGs, which Kenya has committed to achieve by the year 2030, the Government of Kenya, through the Ministry of Agriculture, Livestock and Fisheries, has set up programs tailor-made to achieve these goals. One such program is the Agricultural Sector Development Support Program, ASDSP, whose mandate is to implement the Agricultural Sector Development Strategy with the aim of transforming Kenya's agricultural sector into an innovative, competitive and commercially oriented industry. ASDSP was formulated in 2011. The program had the main goal of uh, supporting commercialization of agriculture. The main strategic objective areas were one, to develop value chains and social inclusion, which was to ensure participation of women and youth in value chain development. In collaboration with various stakeholders, county governments and farmer representatives, some of whom were headed by women and youth, ASDSP identified three key priority value chains that would alleviate poverty in their respective counties. Sisi tunafanya kazi ya nguzi. Nguzi ikishinjwa mama anapewa tu nguzi aende akauze. Wakati tunauza hii ngozi, brokers nao wanakuja na wananunua na pesa kidogo sana. Sababu wanaweza kununua na shilingi 20 ama shilingi 30 ama shilingi 50. Ambayo ni kidogo sana kwa matumizi ya nyumbani. Sasa ndiposa tukakaa kama kikundi na SDSP wakakuja na masomo ya value addition. Na wakatuonyesha kwamba Ngozi inaweza pia kuwa value added such that uki, uki, ukiongeza dhamana ya hiyo ngozi inakupatia faida kubwa kuliko vile unaweza uza ngozi tu ikiwa hivyo. Kubadilisha hiyo ngozi inatumia pesa kidogo sana. Hata itashukua shilingi 100 kubadilisha. Lakini nayo ukishatengeneza hiyo ngozi inakuletea pesa mingi sana. Na huku watuoni hasara ya kutengeneza hiyo ngozi kwa sababu tunatumia materials ambazo tunapata locally. Eh, kuna mambo mawili ambayo nafikiri ni muhimu sana kwa ufugaji wa ngombe wa maziwa. The stakeholder and value chain forums tasked with identifying the key priority value chains had women and youth playing key roles that articulated issues shaping the agricultural value chains. For the effective running of the program ASDSP encouraged women in various counties to form working groups along the key value chains. Kwa mama hasa tumependelea biashara ya maziwa ngamia. Kwa sababu iko unique. Wengi hawakuwa kwa hiyo biashara, ni wachache walikuwa kwa hiyo biashara ya maziwa ngamia. Tulipoanza hatakuwa tunajua maana ya kikundi. Kila mtu alikuwa anachukua maziwa yake ya 10 liter, 5 liter. Tunakaa kwa barabara tukikaa huko mchana mzima vumbi yote tunatumia ma plastic na hatujui kama tunafaidika ama tunaenda hasara tukiwa hapo ndo SDP tatutembelea tukafanya baseline survey wakazunguka Garissa county na sisi tumebahatika tulikuwa mmoja wakati hiyo kila mama alikuwa kipeke yake kwa barabara so wakaonelea hawa ma, ma individuals ambaye wako hapa at least to form groups na tuwafunze kuwapatia elimu kumuhumu ya kikundi kukuja pa moja kuweka rasimali mali moja mwana hawa wako na maona mzuri 
and still there's expansion to answer for an individual to end up with a kikundi to get to a kikundi side to a corporate to form a corporate society. Through ASDSP, the group got financial support from the county government and other partners to acquire milk pasteurizers that have added the shelf life of their milk. This has also seen an increase in the value of their milk from $1 to $3 per liter. Tukio kwa kikundi kazi inaenda haraka. Sasa for example, shamba kama 1 acre kama hii ni 1 and a half. Tukio kwa kikundi wa 20 tukija wote tutapalilia hiyo shamba siku moja. Left tunaenda kwa mwingine. Badala ya mumea kuharibika imetoa flowers, wewe bado unachukua kota na mtu mmoja kwa shamba na unapata imesharibika. We basically work with groups because it means we can reach more people by bringing uh, groups together and also would want uh, the concept of group to work because uh, people who have a common interest if they come together and bring their resources together then it's easier to uplift each other would also want the volumes the market demands volumes and for us to be able to get these volumes then it means we have to work with groups <laughs> Women were also encouraged to take up more leadership positions in the already established groups with mechanisms being set in the program to achieve a more equal representation of women in leadership while observing the one-third gender rule. With the group set up, ASDSP provided training and skills improvement seminars based on the value chain that the groups had identified. This facilitated access to information and development of skills on women and youth within the value chain. SDS Peter na wakuja wakutusaidia, wakatupeleka training, wakutuka training wa jinsi ya kutengeneza products, kama mishipi, vibeti, na kathalika. So wakati wali to train, sasa tukansa kutengeneza bidazetu, sasa kwa kama sasa kwa ngozi moja, tunayasapata saidi ya shilingi elifu moja. The access to information was implemented on the group's agricultural activities, resulting to agri-based households seeing an increase in production and improved value addition on their agricultural products. Sasa mimi kwa kikundi yangu kulingana na vile tulikuwa tunavuna, tulivuna njuku zenye tujaiona. Nikabidi hizi njuku hata huwezi ukakula hata shamba tulifanya kazi mingi hata mwenyewe nikachoka. Sasa eka moja na nusu ikanipea magunia 20. Magunia 20 na manisha zile kubwa wacha hizi ndogo za 40. Tuko na magunia kubwa ya 100 gorogoros. Imagine magunia kama haya ambayo mimi sijaiona hata labda pia wewe hujaiona. Hali tulianzia na hali tuko sasa. Sisi leo tumejivunia. Kwa kaunti yetu tuko na pesa almost 140,000. Kuna wafanyakazi tuko na another outlet Dar es Salaam mali inaitwa ambaye kuna wafanyakazi na outlet yetu hapo ni mali ile mama mali tunanzia we are really proud na tunashukuru sana STP through that linkage na baada wana tuko na wao mama sangala wake ni wasangala The impact of the project is not only being felt by the farmer groups but also the communities in which they operate Through the intervention of ASDSP and various other partners, the project is transitioning the family from higher dependence livelihood to a self-reliance status. Tumelimika kama kina mama na hata saa nyingine tukipata pesa mzuri, tumeweza kusaidia wasiana watano kuwapea bursaries. Lisi msichana mmoja amepata hao wasiana wamepata kila msichana amepata shilingi 2200. Na hiyo pesa imetoka imetokana na hiki kuni. Sisi kama kina mama tunaona at least ni mwenyewe naweza jisimamia. Ukiniomba nipe shilingi 200 naweza kupea lakini hapo kitambo ilikuwa hata shilingi kumi kiberiti na ngojea mzee. Mwambie kiberiti hakuna lakini saa hii mwenyewe naweza jisimamia naweza toa hata akilemewa na mpati yako check ya 10000 pelekea watoto. Eh yeah. hapo ndio faida tumepata alafu tena chakula iko kwa nyumba. It's for this reason that ASDSP has been nominated for the United Nations Public Service Award in the category of promoting gender responsive public service to achieve the sustainable development goals.